Okay, dear students, today we are with the second video of the fill in the blanks for P2 class. Let's go to the first question. All muscles in the anterior compartment of the arm are innervated by which nerve? That is the musculocutaneous nerve. Number two, the median nerve innervates the muscle in the anterior compartment of forearm. With the two exceptions, Number three, most intrinsic muscles of the hand are innervated by ulnar nerve. All muscles in the posterior compartment of the arm, forearm are innervated by the radial nerve. Number five, the axillary nerve which splice the deltoid muscle, a major abductor of the humerus at which joint? That is the glenohumeral joint. Now go to the number six. The cephalic and the basilic vein originate from the dorsal venous arch or dorsal venous network on the back of the hand. Number seven, which angle is used to find the position of rib second as a reference for counting the ribs? That is the sternal angle, also known as angle of Lewis. Uh, question number eight, the which plane passing through the disc that separate the thoracic vertebra from T4 to T5 is one of the most significant planes in the body. That is the horizontal plane passing through that. So number nine, the thoracic aorta is present in which part of the mediastinum that is present in the posterior mediastinum. The highest thoracic uh, the dermatome on the anterior chest wall which is also extended into the upper limb that is the T2 the highest uh, thoracic wall dermatome is T2 thank you very much see you guys in the next video